So this is me walking without the DJI stabilizer. This is me walking with a DJI stabilizer. My name is Rose and I hope you're doing good today and for today's video I am very excited and happy because finally I got this product and I just want to share to you um, my thoughts and if it's worth it and last week I was thinking should I get the old one or the new one and I I saw a lot of good reviews of the people was impressed with this new um, released product and so that's why I got it so today we are gonna unbox the DJI mobile 4 and I am very happy so yes guys without further ado let's unbox this now <laughs> Make a mess over there. Oh my god. So see at the back, um, you will see create magnetic moment. Because the old DJI, it's a month. So now they made it easier for vloggers um, to have it just magnetic. So it's very convenient because sometimes the month, the, the one that I'm using right now, the ring light from Walmart, it's month. So I need to stretch them out and some of them is kind of hassle but this one is uh, magnetic that's why I got it <laughs> and especially I will use this if I go travel so yeah so wait I don't know where to start <laughs> opening this thing I think I'm opening a door yet wait Nice! Okay, so you'll open it here on the bottom. Oh my god, I didn't see that. Okay, and there's a sticker. And it says here, magnetic quick mod, foldable and portable, active track, quick roll, gesture control, story mode. So we will see if it's gonna be like that. Oh my god, wait. Hi, so now... So here, um, we will see the magnetic, like, mont. Mm. It says here, create magnetic moments. Oh my god. Okay, so they will, they will, they will look at later. So here, it is the... We'll close that one first. I like surprises. <laughs> so here um, we have the bag. So for this is for if you're traveling, of course you're not gonna bring the box. <laughs> so you can just put it, I guess, here. And we have here the the one that you can check of which um, which part of the phone you need to put it exactly and oh my god here's the 
magnet that we can put it on our phone. So here, what is this? So I think this is extra, extra magnet. I don't know, it looks like. And oh my god, there's a lot of instruction here. The yeah, instruction. I am very lazy of <laughs> reading instructions, so sometimes if I'm looking for a certain like answer <laughs> for a product, I just go to YouTube and check how to do it. So yeah, here's the magnetic um, thing that you can put at the back of your phone like that and now hi tada oh my god i'm speechless it's so pretty oh my the first impression about the color in real life oh my god it's gray light gray it's very classy so this is the dji Oh my god, I can't believe this is my first time to hold the DJI. And here is the tripod, I believe. So here. Wait, I'm gonna put it here. Wait, I'm gonna move from the table. So here. The tripod. The the wire adapter. Yeah, for charger. And this is a C cable. Type C cable and oh my god, this is my favorite. The one that you can just put um, at the back of your phone. And this one, I don't know, it's like cover. Oh, riser pad for small phones iPhone 7, iPhone 8, SE2, Samsung S8. Okay, so I think for this is for small <laughs> phones. And because I, since I have I, iPhone 11 Max Pro, so I don't need this. Now we are gonna, because in their advertisement, it says that you can just like, like push it. I, I, I don't know, where, where should I click it? For them, it was so easy to do it, like, chuck. It's not letting me. Ah, you open. Hello. Oh, oh my God. I need to put um this one to my phone in order for it to to activate. To activate. Wait, wait, wait. So guys, I have two choices here. So if I decided to put it permanently on my phone, or I can just use this one. So I think I will just use this one because right now I'm wearing a case on my phone because I don't want them um to get damaged or scratched at the back. So I am not gonna use this one, so I'm just gonna save it. So now, um, we were gonna put it, the tripod here. Oh my god. My phone. I have a clear case and someone's picture at the back. <laughs> so we need to get, we need to target the exact location for this magnet. So it's gonna be, um, so it's gonna be balanced. Oh Lord, okay, so that's how you do it. Okay. Oh, I think this one is only for the ring. If I use the other, just the ring magnet, but I'm gonna use the mount. So I am mount. I'm just gonna use this here. So, here it go. Ay, Lord! Ay, oh my god, hindi ko pa nagamit. Wait. Here, here's our phone, and we will 
um, they say you need to make I mean there is uh, you need to put the DJI in the right place and because it's gonna twist <laughs> everywhere turn around so you need to arrange it first before you put um, the mont so this one oh now we were gonna oh. so this is it <laughs> no uh, we need to turn it on and I hope this is balanced already wait Is it on? Oh my god! Okay. <laughs> oh my god, first time, wait. So now, um, we will go to the app. So I didn't upload the app yet. DJI. Owen DJI O Yeah, we need to download the DJI Mimo. Yeah, get get the oh my god. Let me look at it first. Oh my god, this is my new baby, so I need to learn how to use it. Finally, we just downloaded the app. So now we're gonna open it. And you will see here, terms of use. Then you can just click immediately. And agree. And agree. And it will ask you, allow DJI Mimo to use your location. I'll choose always. Would you like send? DJI Mimo would like to send you notifications to allow you would like to find and connect to the device on your local network. Okay. Then DJI Mimo would like to use Bluetooth. Yes. Okay. They would like to access the microphone. Okay. And DJI Mimo would like to access your phone to all photo. So now, um, we were gonna start here. So tap here to select file and start editing. Here on the bottom, the middle. And tap here on the left corner on the, to connect to device. You have this one because just in case that we drop it. So where should I put this one we wait for our... Okay, so here. For support. So when you go outside, you can just do it like this. So we, the firmware just got installed, and we're here outside to try them if it's really worth it or not. So now I am still opening this one. To select. You have to select object that you want to follow. Oh, it's so, so it's supposed to be a person here. Right now, it's following the sun. So I think I will focus this phone. And... Is it moving now? Moving in wrong direction, readjust and move away from the small object slowly. Oh. Okay. We will see if it's gonna follow me. Oh my god, 
just all over. Oh my god, what just happened? Oh my god! It's a very good capture over here. I love it! I need to check if this is gonna be panel. Wait, I think I will turn on the gesture. Oh my god! <gasps> Triplet! So this so is me this walking, is me walking with a DJI stabilizer. So it's kinda cute over there. <laughs> and now, okay, now we're gonna try to, to run back. This is how they do in their advertisement. Just like, like that. Then, wait. And now, we're gonna try to um, check other features. Yeah. Video. So the M button here is gonna make you um, change it to landscape or portrait. So if I'll change one click is record like um, video and one one click is for photo and if I click twice it's gonna be landscape or portrait. So that's the <laughs> portrait. Then here's the landscape and the joystick over here is gonna make um, all the directions follow and the red button here is gonna make it take photos or video that one if I wanted to have the video I just need to click here and now yeah, it's gonna start recording and there is a lot of on features that you can learn from this gimbal and I really like their firmware because it's very friendly and it has all the instructions that I need to um, to know so guys um that's all for today and I will just give uh, my quick conclusion my review on what is my impression um, for the DJI um, I can just say that it's very awesome it's like everything that you need <laughs> if you're a vlogger and i will definitely say that it's gonna make my vlog time stand better and i'm very excited to use this in the future vlogs that i'm gonna do because it's very handy and the grip is very good and everything every camera features that i wanted to have um, they have it here in dji mimo <laughs> um, firmware and I will definitely suggest this um, to you guys if you're planning to have a stabilizer. Definitely get the DJI Mimo. I, I mean, definitely get the DJI Mobile 4. And so like this, it's like cinematic when I move. And it's very perfect if I go somewhere. So guys, um, you just need to invest something if you want. Um, a good quality and you will never get wrong if you're gonna get the DJI OM4 so guys um if you like this video um please give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe my channel and click the notification bell button so you will get notified whenever I uploaded a new video and thank you so much again for watching and have a great day take care always